show I can be a good citizen. Do you want to be in the Good Citizens Club? Yes. I can't hear you. Yes. I still can't hear you. Yes. You must take the test of good citizenness. Whatever it is, I'll do my very best. Yes, yes, yes. So. Your first test will be to paint the clubhouse inside and out so it looks nice before the first meeting of the Good Citizens Club. Inside and out? <sighs> uh, is that too hard? Because instead you could... Absolutely not too hard for me. I am happy to do my best to make the Good Citizens Club look fabulous for everyone. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Start on that side. You're blocking my tan over there. I don't know. I think that blue clashes with my eyes. Can you do a lighter shade? What's that? Here, give me the paintbrush. More like it. That looks like a rabbit. It looks like a flower. It doesn't. Does too. It doesn't. Does too. It doesn't. <sighs> Finished. Exactly the way we wanted it. Are you sure you think it's not good? Should you do it over? No, no, it looks terrific, really. Let's wait to get the other member's opinion before we go changing anything. So is that it? Do I get my pin now? Well, uh, you finished the first test. Congratulations! First test? How many are there? Uh, a three. Yeah, three skirts. Yeah, we always use three. Uh-huh, that's right. Oh. <sighs> to this year's Very Bitty Buggy Derby. <laughs> You're all going to have a wonderful time. So please, help me welcome the official Very Bitty Buggy Derby driver. <laughs> present our esteemed derby drivers. <sighs> oh no, they've forgotten how to do the introduction. <laughs> oh yeah, I remember now. <laughs> Thanks, Blueberry. Done. I bet she forgot. And with this traditional ceremonial derby scepter, I hereby declare that the derby has begun. <laughs> what a wonderful ceremony! like the old days. Thanks to you, Blueberry. I think you've shown the princess very good manners by so closely following the traditions of her favorite event. Thanks. I do feel I've made it up to the princess for my bad manners earlier. At least a little. <laughs> <laughs> Can't you tell us what's the matter? Oh, if I told you, you'd never believe me. Better you should see with your own eyes. Oh, we'll see what? Uh. <gasps> see that. Oh, what's happened to that glimmerberry plant? <sighs> it's caught a case of the rare, the unusual, the mysterious Platus Modus. What is woozus? Platus bonus. It's a condition which causes the plants to turn plaid and polka dotted. Oh, is it bad? Oh, it's not good. And from a fashion sense, plaid and polka dots, awful. 
What causes it? That's a mystery. I recall reading somewhere it's a lack of a certain vitamin. But which one, I can't recall. Does it hurt the berries? Uh, not that I remember, but I don't know for sure. Oh, can, can you do anything? Hmm. Well, maybe if I mixed up a batch of extra special vitamin plant food. Why, yes, that's it. Wonderful idea. Off I go. Well... Guess we'd better get to the pond if we want to go swimming today. Yeah, I guess. Very nice, girls. Oh, it looks great. And the best part? We're a full day ahead of schedule. Ooh, which means I have time tomorrow to sew up some fancy tablecloths. Mm -hmm. And I have time to pick out some great music. <laughs> <laughs> the fall is going to be so much fun. True, but there's still plenty of work to do tomorrow. Let's get some rest, and I'll see you here bright and early. One shelf? Not as impossible as it seems? Oh, what am I gonna do with this? But it is the biggest first frost gift ever! I got it! This is the perfect secret gift for my secret giftee! Plum! <laughs> She's gonna. <laughs> Dresses for us so quickly, Raspberry. They're 
beautiful and so fancy. <laughs> Gee, well, thank you. I mean, it's just what I do. Where's Blueberry? What's she wearing? A lot of notes. Huh? Good evening, Mr. Bumblebee. My, you're looking well this evening. Uh, well, thank, thank you, Blueberry. You're also looking... Offer to shake hands. Oh, yeah. Blueberry, what are you doing? Good evening, Miss Pudding. My, you're looking well this evening. That's what you said to the postmaster. It's me, Plum. I just want to have the best manners possible so everything goes well. For the princess, don't you think you're overdoing it just a little bit? When it comes to good manners, there's no such thing as overdoing it. Hi, Berry King Blue. Don't forget to shake hands. Huh? Uh. This is the Derby Ball, after all. We have to be proper. Raspberry, it's impolite not to wait your turn. But, uh, Jadybug told me to go ahead of her because she's still deciding. No, no, no. No bad manners at this ball. <laughs> Orange, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just going to rest a second. Ooh, I was dancing my feet off out there. But, but you're slouching. That's not good manners. It isn't? Oh, oh, it's okay. No one can see me. But somebody might. And what if it's the princess? There, perfect. Psst, Plum. Is your napkin in your lap? Uh, yes. Don't chew with your mouth open. Wasn't going to. No elbows on the table. Do you see them on the table? Be sure not to slurp your tea. Ugh. Anything else? Yes, sit up straight. Hey, where's Blueberry? She's busy, minding everybody else's manners. What's that? Well, you see, she's been running around correcting everyone's manners whenever they make a mistake. She corrected me before I even made a mistake. She really needs to relax. Hmm. Hi there, Blueberry. Enjoying the ball? Well, no. Why not? Oh, Strawberry. I'm just so worried someone is going to offend the princess with bad manners. I think you should just try to have fun. You don't need to worry about how things are going. Okay. Just as soon as I finish the chapter on the salad fork, the misunderstood utensil. Blueberry, did you forget about our nature hike? Gun detecting. I wonder what that means. Blueberry, are you in there? Hello? You there! Blueberry? Detective Blueberry. How do I look? Like... <laughs> Patty Persimmon. Thanks! What are you up to? Wait, don't tell me. Let me figure it out like Patty does. She really knows how to get into the mind of a criminal. Criminal? Mm-hmm. 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 Well, my keen powers of deduction tell me that you're... Going on a nature hike. How'd you guess? It was no guess. I asked myself, why would these girls have butterfly nets and binoculars? What a coincidence. We were just asking ourselves, why don't we have nature guidebooks? What nature guidebooks? The ones you were going to bring? Oops. I think they got boxed up to make room for all the new Patty Persimmon mysteries. Well, are you going to join us for the hike? You might want to change. Oh, girls, I'm sorry. I don't want to hold you up. See, I really need to practice my detecting skills. We have muffins, your favorite blueberry. You do? Oh, no thank you. I don't care for muffins. Huh? Huh? See you later. I'm off to solve another mystery. 
Uh, isn't it Patty Persimmon who doesn't like muffins? Not Blueberry. I mean, I like Patty Persimmon books too, but what happened to our friend Blueberry? <sighs> That's the real mystery. I've ever received for First Frost. I know! My secret gifty Orange likes to sort things. I bet she'd love this. <gasps> oh, yes, yes. Indeed, yes. It is getting chilly these days, Miss Jadybug. Uh, you know, I have an extra hat you could borrow. Very warm. <laughs> Ha, <laughs> 
<laughs> now that was the most fun I've had in ages. Somebody ought to tell the princess that we should do that every year. Did you hear that? The princess will be so happy. Hey, Blueberry, you know what else friends are for? <laughs> Celebrating when something great happens. <laughs> why I called you here today. Because, uh, we're having book club here today? Besides that, you, uh, figured out who's missing? Aha! Close! It's because I've almost figured out who's missing. Just a few more questions, and this case will be closed like a door slammed in a strong wind. My keen detective mind tells me the answers to those questions are in... This very room! What, uh, sorts of questions? What is this person's favorite food? That'd be muffins. Aha! Especially blueberry muffins. Aha! What about hobbies? Uh, uh well, um, uh, oh, she loves to read books. Aha! It's a girl! You said she! I've gathered the clues and I'm putting them together. She likes the color blue and has a suspicious fondness for blueberry muffins. She likes to read books and should be here at book club if she weren't missing. And the only person like that is... Yeah? Well, who is it? Come on! The suspense is too much! The only person like that is... It's you already! You did it, Blueberry! You solved the mystery! So I'm the missing person? <laughs> That's right. Yeah, uh, guess I haven't been around so much lately, huh? And we've been missing you! Come quick, everyone! To the grove! <laughs> supposed to be secret, but I need to give this gift to you in person and explain why. But what for? It's for First Frost. But, uh, uh, I already got a secret gift. I know. I gave it to you. But it wasn't a secret gift that you would like. It was something I would like. So, here's a secret gift I think you'll like. Oh, Blueberry! The very big book of bountiful braiding! Just what I always wanted! That's the perfect first frost gift for me! <gasps> Uh-oh. Uh-oh what? Uh-oh, I just realized I didn't give Plum the perfect first frost gift. I just gave her the book you gave me. I know. Sorry, Blueberry. Wait! I have just the thing for Plum. <laughs>
I was worried you wouldn't like it as much as the very big book on book sorting. This gift is even better, because it shows me that you really thought about what I like, something only a friend would know. <gasps> you there! Why do the plants look like this? That's the mystery. Something's making them turn plaid and polka dotted. But I'm sure you can find the answer in one of your books. No, 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 no. I'm going to solve this case the Patty Persimmon way. And she always begins by gathering clues. And then comes the fun part. Fun part? Yes. Getting into the mind of the criminal. Asking herself how a criminal thinks. Hmm. Why would plants want to be polka dot and plaid? Maybe they were bored. Uh... Aha! I know what's wrong with these plants. Someone has been painting them. Why would anybody do that? Exactly! That is what I'm going to find out. I'm going to wait for the criminal to return to the scene of the crime. They always do that, you know. I learned it from Patty Persimmon, Genius Detective. <sighs> I'll stay out here all night if I have to. Not a thing will escape my keen eye. And the other one, too. even more plaids and polka dots now. Well, hey, maybe Blueberry solved the mystery. Where is she, anyway? She was around here somewhere. <gasps> hmm. uh, Blueberry? Uh -huh. Aha! You there! So it was you all along. And you're a criminal accomplice. This case is solved. So, what made you do it? Uh, do what? Paint plaids and spots on the berry plants. Uh, we didn't paint anything. Then what are you doing here in the middle of the night? We came to check on you, to make sure you were okay. Actually, it's morning now. Aha! I knew that. I just wanted to see if you knew that I knew. <laughs> you know? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a mystery to solve. Somewhere out here is a master criminal, a fiend with no sense of fashion. 